Yeah, hi there. So today I wanted to talk about upgrading my precision. I purchased a precision Dell um, workstation. It's a T3640 with a Pente uh, Intel Core 5, 10th generation. I wanted to, when I was purchasing it, I wasn't sure what kind of power supply it came with. So when I got it, I discovered it was a standard ATX supply, but I wanted to add a, vi a video card, a additional video card to it. So when I got it and I opened it up, I discovered this was the motherboard connector. This was another motherboard connector. SATA um, connectors, power connectors. And that was it. Right, the power supply that it came with was a Dell. Let's get a close up on this. It's a Dell D300 EGM01. It's a 80 plus gold power supply. Right, it also goes by, by this part number here, ORVH3X. So I contacted the Dell customer support on a chat and the only option they had for this um, machine was another power supply identical to this. They didn't have any power supplies that came with additional connectors. So I did some research on the Dell forums and somebody said this was a standard ATX power supply. So I went and purchased one. So to get access to it, you need to remove the screw that's in the back here. And then you just pull on this and take this cover off. And this was a replacement power supply. And this was the connector I was missing. So if you need to upgrade your precision, you can use a standard ATX power supply to upgrade it with all the connectors you need. As you can see, there's a whole bunch that came with this power supply, uh, much more than you would need. So just be advised that um, this is what you can do to upgrade your Dell Precision T um, machine. All right, if you have any questions, let me know. Like, share, and subscribe if this helped you. And um, comment, make some comments down below. Let me know what you think or if you have any questions. Thanks. Oh yeah, one more thing, the storage housing for the hard drives, they did not come with plastic caddies and these are unique to this machine. So there's something like $20 I think, for if you check eBay for them. Um, I didn't buy any, I just slipped the drive in and it seemed fine. Just don't shake the machine. Right, so um, yeah, uh, there's a lot of unique parts in this machine. And the configuration is different, so just keep that in mind.